Hey coach, uh, so glad you found us. Um, hopefully your hand's up just like this and you wanna learn something and this video will hopefully help you do that. Go over and subscribe so you don't miss anything moving forward. I'm trying to get to 100,000. Let's hope I'll be 90 by the time that happens. But go over and subscribe, that would surely help. Also go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who wanna get better. Down in the show notes, you'll be able to find all about it. Let me help you win more games win some state championships, have more fun in less time, 30 plus years of coaching. Let me help you do that. Let's head off to the video. Okay, let's get into our four corners now. We need four basketballs, four corners. Let's use this one right here, yep, that one right there. Back it up a little bit. Go to the volleyball line right there, yep. Further, further, further. And I need two bodies over here, two in each line. Basketball over there. Just grab one basketball and get over here. Okay, this drill is called four corner passing. All right, it's the second one in my sequence. We are gonna go in a clockwise direction, guys, okay? So all four are gonna pass the ball in the pennant to the next person in line who's ready to receive the basketball. Very good, okay? We are gonna throw two hands, let's throw chest. We'll throw chest passes to start out with. And you can do this with my guys, we actually start wide and then we go narrow. Uh, I just chose an intermediate distance to show everyone. And again, with little guys, the wider the court, the more difficult this becomes. I actually add two dribbles in with my JV guys when we go wide. All right? Chest passes, we're calling out names. Okay, we'll just demo very, just with one here, okay, on what we're gonna do. So we're making a chest pass. You know his name? Yeah. What is it? Harrison. Harrison, you're gonna yell it out loud. Harrison. Good. We pass, we follow our pass to the inside. Inside, inside, inside. And here I jump stop. I pivot and I open, Harrison's going to grab the ball, he's making the chest pass, the next person in line, good, follow your pass, to the inside, jump stop, pivot and open, boom, and we go all the way around, okay, and then you work through all three passes, and actually when I'm in tight I have them roll the ball, we actually practice bending down, picking up the ball and chinning it from that position like it's a loose ball, okay, the other thing I do is also give the extension where we reverse. So instead of going in the clockwise direction, on reverse, they actually go counterclockwise. And with your upper level kids, you can trick them. You're playing mind games with them. You're asking them to think in the spot on the court, okay? And I'll switch passes and directions. And my point guard's actually the one that uh, calls back my command, okay? Or I'll yell for my point guard, bounce pass. He'll yell bounce, and then the team responds back, bounce pass. So again, we're communicating to each other. All right, let's go live. All four bodies moving, chest passes. Here we go. Good, inside, inside, inside. Make sure he's jump spot stopping before I give that pass. Good. Inside, 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 good. Oh, we're pivoting the other direction. Good, and I will also ask him, if that person next in line is not ready to receive the ball, we gotta sit there in triple threat, maybe we're ball faking, and the game my pass is not always open. and freeze, right? And again, the younger the group, the more time it's gonna take to learn this. I probably, and I did when I coached seventh graders, that's where I started to work this drilling, okay? Could sixth graders do it? Yeah, if they're skilled, there's no doubt. Um, and you could, you know, you could take away some things or make the progressions a little bit easier so we aren't throwing as much at them. But it, again, teaches jump stop, triple threat, pivoting, which I think we don't necessarily always think about as skills, but those are definite skills of the game of basketball if we can't do those, all right? Thanks for watching, Coach. Make sure you go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better. Make sure you subscribe so you get notified every time we come back on. But you will not be disappointed with teachhoops.com. 14-day free trial. Let's go check it out. Have a great day.